we can now confirm that Avicii killed himself. Following a couple weeks of speculation and innuendo about the way this beloved DJ died, TMZ reports that the 28-year-old did, indeed, take his own life. We were first alerted to this possibility a few days ago after Avicii's parents released a statement in which they used his real name and said the following, Our beloved Tim was a seeker, a fragile artistic soul searching for answers to existential questions. An overachieving perfectionist who traveled and worked hard at a pace that led to extreme stress. When he stopped touring, he wanted to find a balance in life to be happy and be able to do what he loved most music. He really struggled with thoughts about meaning, life, happiness. He could not go on any longer. He wanted to find peace. Those final two lines, of course, were what really stood about and got people talking about this message. According to TMZ insiders, Avicii used a shard of glass to cut himself, resulting massive bleeding. Two sources tell the aforementioned website that the artist broke a bottle and used the glass from its remains to inflict the fatal wound. One of the sources even specifies that it was a wine bottle. These insiders apparently disagree on whether the musician sliced open his neck or his wrists with the glass. A promoter of EDM music and a DJ with worldwide appeal, along with a string of well-known hits, Avicii was found dead on April 20 in the Middle Eastern country of Oman. He battled alcohol problems for years and his friends worried those concerned would eventually kill him. In our most recent update about how the DJ died, we quoted the Muscat governor at police headquarters, via Radar Online, who claimed that drugs were found in Avicii's hotel room. We cannot report that with certainty, however said the star's publicist upon announcing his client's tragic death last month, it is with profound sorrow that we announced the loss of Tim Bergling, also known as Avicii. He was found dead in Muscat, Oman this Friday afternoon local time, April 20. The family is devastated and we ask everyone to please respect their need for privacy in this difficult time. No further statements will be given, Avicii mourned, remembered on Twitter, read the tributes except Avicii's family did then give a lengthy statement three days later. We would like to thank you for the support and the loving words about our son and brother, it read, continuing as follows, We are so grateful for everyone who loved Tim's music and have precious memories of his songs. Thank you for all the initiatives taken to honor Tim, with public gatherings, church bells ringing out his music, tributes at Coachella and moments of silence around the world. We are grateful for the privacy during this difficult time. Our wish is that it continues that way. With love, the Tim Bergling family, tragic stuff. We also hope that Avicii has at last found peace. We continue to send our thoughts to his family members, friends and loved ones. 25 stars who committed suicide.